Hi, this is Gao Chang from Jiangnan University School of Design, and I'm now working as a user researcher in a design consulting company. And I'm really excited to shoot this video and share a little of my opinions about social change in China. In recent years, economic development and the flow of information have brought more and more young people into the first tier cities, and the problem of living and renting has become a major source of anxiety for young people who live in crap and not cheap spaces. For example, living conditions in Hong Kong are already very poor due to high rent. A lot of young people live in this kind of room, which we call it coffee room, and even such rooms still cost four thousand RMB. At the same time, the single family is slowly becoming the main form of family in China under the background of business convenience and individual times. We have over 10 million young people living alone in the four first tier cities of China. As a result, the traditional design for a family of three has become unsuitable for today's young people. So I started to think about what kind of shelter we need. Is it possible to make our living space more suitable and more affordable? I started with a little research. What impressed me most was a piece of news about private apartment in Shenzhen. During my research time, I used questionnaire to collect the data of about 200 young people under the age of 25 who live in first tier cities, and found it that 68 percent of them were comfortable with such living condition. This reminded me that maybe personal living space is developing towards smaller size. Besides, I noticed that there were already some youth community arising in big cities, but the rent is high and the large deposit and service fee is required. So I have done this design project, which is a modular shared community, offered young people minimum but reasonable private space and maximum shared community. You could know more in my portfolio if you are interested. It's still a concept, but I would like to study more about it. Thank you for watching.